welcome back to my channel or welcome in if you're new. My name is Dream and today is such a great video because we're going to be adding cozy fall touches throughout our home. So the video before this, I gave you guys a huge fall decor haul, but today it's time to get those pieces out into our home. We're going to focus this video on our first floor. So we're going to work our way kind of back forward. We're going to work our way in the living room first, then do a few things in the kitchen and then make our way to the front door, the front um, entryway area. I am going to have a few of these fall decor videos, like I want to cozy up our front porch, I want to do some fun things upstairs, but today we're going to focus on our main level. First things first, um, let's start with our fireplace area. I can't wait to get, I want to get my pumpkins out there. I did put a little fall picture to get me in the mood. I also have our um, fireplace on just to make it that much cozy. So I am so happy that you guys are here and let's get started. So for the man mantle guys, I like to stick actually throughout my whole home with a particular color pattern. So I will be using these wicker um, pumpkins from um, Target. Then I also have these plush ones. I have them in this color, various sizes, and then also in white. And then these smaller white ones as well. I'm gonna throw a few burlap pumpkins in there and then a few from, these are from like a Hobby Lobby pack, um, some off-white and white ones. So that's kind of the color palette. We're gonna start with that and then make our way to the coffee table and the sofa. Mm -hmm. could see yourself just sitting there on my chair I'm staring at you you don't even notice should have told you straight away you don't have to be afraid we are done with the mantle so picture I told you guys I just googled Amazon um, pictures fall pictures with frames and a few came up so I loved this one this little steel life um, and then various pumpkins Hobby Lobby Amazon the greenery is from Hobby Lobby this fall banner is from um, Amazon and then we have florals from Target and Amazon on the ends but I like how everything came out it's super duper pretty to secure everything my mantle is from the 1800s my husband and my father-in-law um, built this for me when we moved to our home you guys know we bought a new built home two years ago, so we've been adding little things to give it character. So this mantle, 1800s, it's very, very, very old, this piece of wood. So I just tuck everything in the crevices, in cracks, which I love about my mantle. And that is how I secure everything there. But looking good, love it. And now we're gonna move on to the sofa. Mm -hmm.
Let's start with the coffee table. I just have um, this cozy white cottage seasons book from Amazon. This, um, I like to keep it practical, but still with cute stuff. This um, Kleenex box, that is also from Amazon, that leather. I love the leather tone. I love it all year round, but it's particularly, I you know, cozy in the fall and winter seasons. I do have this amber glass um, candle holder. That's from Target. And then this DIY candle I made last year. I decorated last year um, is in that. And then we have this bin here. That is from, that wicker bin is from Target. You guys can see I love adding that throughout my home. I have quite a few plants that I've added this year and I just don't wanna like get rid of them. So our plant is still on our coffee table. And then I added this textured um, pumpkin that I love the shape of it and everything. And that is actually from Aldi. Okay, let's make our way to the sofa. I have this plush um, blanket that I threw over the side. That is from Home Goods. The striped pumpkin is from um, Walmart. I like to mix all the textures. I have another striped um, pillow that is from Amazon. The cream colored um, pillow is from Walmart. And then we have the um, soft Sherpa pumpkin pillow that I absolutely love and that is from Big Lots and then over here we have a leather lumber pillow and that is from um, Amazon and then the same three pillows over here so love our little setup nice and cozy and all ready for the fall season okay guys I made me some chai tea I feel like the living room's done. I wanna move on to the kitchen next, but I have all these vessels that had spring and summer florals in them, but I cleared them out. All of my vessels are from Hobby Lobby. So this one, and I like to get them when there's a discount on them. And then this picture I always use as, uh, to put faux or real flowers in there. And then I also have this one from Hobby Lobby that I got on clearance, I think last year. Um, I have, my bracelet was caught to my hair. I have, um, an array of florals. So I have these stems. Um, these like mom looking ones. What else do we have? And I love the bushel. <laughs> I, that's what I call them. If you guys know the real name for these, let me know. But I have these different bushels. I love that color. That's kind of like the color of my skirt that I'm wearing today. But love those. And then I have them in white as well. And then just a few greenery pieces. But I'm going to use everything that I have. And we're going to make three um, arrangements. I think this one I'm gonna put in my master bedroom. Um, this one for our kitchen table. And then this one by our soap dispenser in the sink, so. Let's get ready to do that. My cup is actually from Aldi, but let's get ready to put all that stuff together. From the sunshine on my face So dehydrated, don't know what to say Who's sleeping by my side? What did I do last night? Can someone make this headache go away? Yesterday was supposed to be quiet Being to myself and sit in silence Till I got a call, my friend showed up at my door They wanted me to go out for a while We were dancing in the dark With a feeling in our eyes Felt like we had it all We were dancing in the dark Hey guys, 
So I made this little one for in the kitchen. It has whatever these things are called. I call them pom-poms, but this and then a little greenery piece. I think I got this from Target, but, and then the vessel is from Hobby Lobby, but I think that'll be cool, cute. Um, our bedroom's a bit more like neutral. So I did make this neutral one in this um, Hobby Lobby picture and it just has the mums in there and then these little wheat stems. And then this one is for the kitchen table. I needed something a little bit more massive. So it has the wheat stems in there, the pumpkins, whatever these little palms are called and some greenery too, but I think it's pretty and it's cute and very in the mood for fall. So we are going to, I'm gonna wipe down things in the kitchen just a little bit and we're gonna start in here and then I'll do an overview of the kitchen. I do need to change out a few things in the hutch as well, so we gotta get over there and then the front door. With a feeling in our hearts, felt like we Let's do a kitchen walkthrough, but I wanted to start with the hutch. I just added like a pumpkin there, a little lantern there, and another pumpkin there. So nothing crazy, just added a little bit of orange. Um, our dining table. I just put that arrangement that we made there and then these two. I'm going to do a separate video on like a cute little tablescape, but this is good for like every day. And now for the kitchen, we have fall in love, that little sign there, and then that arrangement that we made on that little trivet tray. Here we have those bowls from Home Goods, that canister from Target, and then this is from Target as well. We have um, a pumpkin back here, a little um, pumpkin tray. Our stove is like neutral. I keep my everyday hand towel, and then we have like a little candle there from Target. And then over here, we just have an another little pumpkin cutting board with the rest of our cutting boards. My mugs, I do them here because I have a plug-in electric tea kettle that I will, when I want tea, I put it in there. So I like my mugs here, and then this, I'll use these cute little things as like a little stir stick for my honey and stuff that I put in my tea. But that is the kitchen, guys. That's it. Looks good, simple, pretty, and now we're going to head on over and do the front entryway. Entryway, um, I just have, this is a real plant. I'm leaving it there, of course. And then I just added that plush pumpkin here with this pillowcase from um, Amazon. And then this throw blanket is from Target. And that bench is actually from Tractor Supply. And on this side of the front entryway, I just have some pillows in a basket. The leather pillow is from Amazon. The striped one is from Home Goods, And then there is a little basket that I got from Michaels. Here, I kind of stripped everything down. Um, I wanna add some ribbon to that wreath and then decorate this area. Who's sleeping by my side? What did I do last night? Can someone make this headache go away? Yesterday was supposed to be quiet Being to myself and So on this area we have the wreath and I added that um, burnt orange ribbon and then we have a family picture here, our stack books and then this um, cloche from the antique store and it has a little pumpkin inside of it super cute we have our candlesticks here from hobby lobby this i think i got from michael's and in there we have some um like pumpkins and pine cones 
we have our um, lanterns down here and then I put that give thanks sign there. Here we have um, some filler. It has like little pumpkins, little pine cones, and then I, I have a picture, a Halloween picture from last year. But that is this cute little area and I think it came out great. And that is it guys, that is a wrap on our fall clean and decorate with me for 2024. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you got some ideas of fun um, decorating things to do around your home just to cozy it up. And like I said, we are gonna tackle upstairs another day and the front porch and I can't wait. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys very soon with a whole new one. Bye everybody. Mm -hmm.